Both models lead off with a typical adventure beak feature at the front of the fairing that gets back up from the high side, full-length fender that mounts to the fork feet and doubles as a fork guard to protect the swept area of the inner fork tube from the grit and debris that could destroy the fork seal. The headlights come in an over-under arrangement recessed in the front of the new fairing design with an adjustable windshield that comes bended to smooth out airflow and reduce turbulence at the border of the rider's pocket and the slipstream. No matter which one you choose, you can look forward to some hand protection to go with the newly redesigned front end. Good for riding in the rain, cold and combinations thereof, plus you can ride confident in the knowledge that you'll never wind up with a pissed off and injured bee slash wasp slash stinging flying thing stuck between the fingers of your mesh summer gloves. A 5.3 gallon fuel tank gives the bee strong that characteristic hump that get accentuated even more by the deep scoop seat that thoughtfully includes a junk pad on a slope at the rear of the tank so you hopefully, won't bruise your naughty bits during hard-breaking maneuvers. I guess that's one good thing to be said for forward controls. Plenty of forward bracing, 